So we've seen how to add a basic stack navigator to our application. Let's now add some tabs to our application. For that, first let's import tab navigator. The tab navigator is also imported from React navigation like we imported the stack navigator earlier. Next, we'll have to define the tab navigator. Let's call it home screen tab navigator. Here we have to create a set of screens. So let's call the first screen the home screen. And we'll point to a screen named home screen. And let's call the second one notifications. And it points to a screen called notifications. So we already have a home screen created over here. Let's also create the notification screen. And let's put in a view here, which has a text, which says this is the notification screen. We need to make sure that from here, we also change this to export our home screen tab navigator. Let's save that and test it out. So here, when the user now goes to the home screen, it should show the home screen tab navigator. There we are on the home screen. We have a home screen tab and a notifications tab. So as you can see right now, the tab navigator looks very basic. The act na navigation does allow us to add a lot of customizations to our tab navigator. We will just add one basic one right now. So coming here, we can just add it. We'll say animation enabled equal to true. Here now we'll see when you come here, clicking on the tab shows that nice slide animation. So now we know how to structure our basic app. We have a stack navigator inside which we've added a tab navigator, which is how most usual apps are. So in the next videos, we'll build on something and create a new app.